Traveling in the Philippines is one of the biggest joys of my life. Not only because of the beautiful sceneries different places in the country have to offer, but also because of the meaningful experience which comes with each site's historical and cultural importance. One of my goals for 2023 is to travel more within the country. So for the first trip of the year, I'm going to an urban escape in Silang, Cavite, a city that isn't so far from Metro Manila. Hey guys, it's Jessica here. So right now I am on the way for a nice getaway family trip to Silang, Cavite. And the weather is actually really bad right now. Like it's been raining cats and dogs. So I don't know how the weather is going to be when we actually get there, but we are actually going to a very, very cool place. It's like an indigenous hut, housing place where you can sleep at like a tree house. Alright guys, so the sun is starting to show up slowly, so we have hope. Because like there's a place where we can do a campfire there and stuff, and also it's supposed to look really nice because it's a foresty area. <sighs> Unless it rains and it becomes a nightmare probably. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> Guys, I think Silang is famous for plants, so I see a lot of plant shops on the way. Alright guys, so we have arrived. Oh my god, I love the entrance already. This is the terraces. Yeah. The banana rice terraces in Ifuga, we bring it here, but this is the flower terraces going down. Oh. Yes. Mm -hmm. So this place, Shambhala Silang, it's a place that draws inspiration from the rich art and culture of the Filipino indigenous people and the beauty and bounty of our natural surroundings. So as you guys know, as someone who is very much interested in the indigenous art and culture of the Philippines, I was so excited to come to this place. Especially these indigenous huts which actually came from Ifugao Mount Province and Sagada. I mean, Look how beautiful it is. I'm going to sleep here today. So, this is a little room tour. This is the outside um, chilling area. And then, 
this is the upstairs space, which is bed space and a little mini window, Rapunzel window. And then this is the bathroom. Guys, this is the type of house that I want to build um, and like just live on my own like far in the future. Like in a little rural town in the Philippines. I want to build a little hut like this. That's the mini hut that we were staying at with this amazing view. Wow. After enjoying the sunset and enjoying the only moment where it kind of stopped raining, we went straight for dinner. <laughs> Wow, it's so good. So this is the bangus. Bangus? And then this is the vegetable lumpia. And this is the chicken. Chicken. Barbecue. Yep. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. How's chicken in the It's so tender. で、感じるまじで前なんで。じゃあね、いいオリジナルウェイソースで違うものがいっぱいあって。めっちゃそうね。で、違うチリがさんてが味じょうわ。じゃあ、出た。じゃあ、じゃあ、オージーウェイソース
아니야? 원래 이름피아가 이 안에 석재료가 뭐가 들어간 거예요? 보통? 당근지 식재 아, 원래? 어. 난 룸피아가 석이 이름지 나 처음 봤어 돼지고기 같은 거 들어간 거야 그렇지 않냐? 그거는 룸피아 샹하이 That was an amazing dinner 아니, guys, I remember wearing this like in my Buanang Wika during my elementary days. This is their uh, Botanic Gardens. Ah, they did this in their clothes before. Oh. Here's that. Because Batanes is the window of the Typhoon. That's why. Ah, Batanes. Yes. Wait, the north, north island, yes, the small that, island. That, that, ah. <laughs> 내가 하나 사가고 싶어. 머리가 잠깐만. 내가 하나 사가고 싶어. 오 사자 같은데. 아 예쁘다. Guys, apparently this place is actually built by the Ifugao people like 15 years ago, and it was open to the public recently, I think. Oh my god, guys, it's like raining so hard again. Otto, come here. You're so lucky to have lechon kawali as dinner. I think Otto is a very common cat name in the Philippines. 십중 팔고 오토야. 그래? 잘 먹네. Sadly enough, we weren't able to push through our bonfire, but to turn things around, it was actually very nice to just hear the sound of the rain in the gubo. It was such a peaceful and calming moment. So carrying this vibe, our family decided to sleep early and hope that we'll get to see some sun tomorrow. All right, guys. So this is our bed space. So definitely, you can have a very good time with your family when you're sleeping at a such a tight space like this. And there's another addition to the family over there, showering. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So our fam all got ready for bed. Nice little cozy hut. No Wi-Fi here, by the way. So you know, away from gadget. We were all using Wi-Fi using LTE. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> away from gadget. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, I'll see you tomorrow morning. Good night. Good morning. The moment our family has been waiting for. The sun finally showing up.